I'm gonna show you how to deep clean your cloths. So this is gonna be your boil. Remember you only get four of these a year, so don't waste them. Now here's my pot of boiling water. I'm gonna add a teaspoon, because I have quite dirty cloths and quite a few, to my boiling water of the Norwex Ultra Power Plus laundry detergent. And then I'm just gonna start adding some cloths slowly in there. So I'm gonna add a few cloths. And see how many I can fit. I'm gonna grab my tongs here and just see what I can fit in there. And turn down my temperature or my speed here a little bit on my burner. Um, so we have plenty going on there. So you can see they're in there. I could probably fit one more in there for sure, maybe a couple. We'll put a couple more in there and see. So I'm gonna get them in there. Sorry. So I have them in there and I'm gonna let them just keep boiling. I'm gonna set my timer for 10 to 15 minutes, depending on how bad they really are. And then we're gonna just let them boil like that. So I'm gonna pause this and I'll be back in a little bit. Okay, we're back at it and you can see the water is really dirty. My timer's up. So I am going to just shut the, the stove off and I'm gonna dump this out and let it all cool. And then I'm gonna rinse it and wring it or throw it into the washing machine and do another wash, especially because these are so dirty. You can see how dirty that water is. It's really pretty disgusting. Um, let me grab my tongs and I'll actually try and show you that you can't even see to the bottom of my pan. So it's very, very, very murky and um, dark water. So very dingy a lot of junk got pulled out of these claws and this will happen that's why i do recommend that at least once a year you should be doing this anyway if not more but no more than four times a year because you don't want to wear out your cloth before it's time so you want to get your money's worth out of it so don't over boil it do some hot soaks which a way you can do that is like in the beginning the boiling water bring that to a boil put your soap in Put your claws in there, but shut it off. Don't let it keep boiling. And you can do that a little bit more often than the actual boiling process. So hope you enjoyed this tip and learned how to do a boil on your claws. Thank you, everyone. It's